Hello, Warriors. Happy Saturday. It's Coach Bowden here, and I wanted to talk at least a little bit today, give you guys some updates uh, as we look to the weeks ahead of what the summer is going to look like for cross country. And unfortunately, I don't have a ton of information right now. What I'm doing is I just wanted to say hi. Miss coaching you guys during track season. Looking forward to cross country season in the fall. Uh, and as the weather turns, it's, it's turning beautiful, beautiful weather for running right now. What we need to talk about is, okay, first of all, camp. Okay, originally, camp was going to start on June 3rd. Chances are, at this point, that's not going to happen. You know, safety guidelines are still in place regarding COVID-19. And uh, the administration, in the interest of keeping everybody safe and healthy, is definitely, I think, I'm pretty sure they're, poking, they're like canceling all youth camps throughout June. And they're postponing everybody else. But as soon as I hear anything, I will let you guys know. So and unfortunately, we're probably not going to start cross-country camp as soon as June starts. Okay, But it doesn't mean we won't have camp at all this summer. Okay? You know, guidelines being as they are, uh, things are, are you know slowly opening up, getting lifted. Uh, we don't have a ton of people. You know, it's not like I have a bus full of 70 kids. Um, I was talking with Coach Willis about the boys the other day, and we, you know, what we may do is all alternate days so that the bus isn't as crowded, one day girls, one day boys, you know, so on and so forth. But yeah, what we're looking at is even if we're not going to have camp right away, you guys can, of course, start training. Uh, whether you've come off of track and, you know, if you've finished track or what should have been track season, you know, you're entering your break period where you should be resting your legs a little bit, doing some cross training, going on some hikes, bikes, things like that, but not necessarily running all that much. You know, if you're coming off of what would have been soccer for people like Sydney and Katie and Mackenzie and Sophia and other soccer players, you know, what you can do is you can start transitioning a little bit. Uh, you know, it would have been nice. I don't know if you've been training at all, working out at all, but, you know, start, start getting the miles in a little bit. Uh, what I'm including in this email is the summer calendar. Don't forget, or the, the summer running log, I should say. Summer calendar will come later once we figure out when we can run or not. But the summer running log to help you keep track. You know, I was happy with what we did last year in summer miles, hoping to keep up in the game a little bit more every single year. It's definitely something that will help you as the season uh, approaches, getting ready for what, what's ahead of you in the fall because, you know, I, as far as I know, we're still going to have cross country. We're still going to have a great fall. I you know, hope we all are back to school and things are back to normal. We shall see, but you got to prepare like it, like it's going to be normal. Like there's going to be cross country. And Hey, for a lot of you, you know, it's a good way to start your day or a good way to end your day. It can kind of break up the day, give you something to look forward to. The main idea is just to get out there and get running. So remember 250 miles uh, is for the goal for varsity. 200 for fresh soft and JV and 150 for middle schoolers, okay, junior high kids. If there are anybody, I've, I'm sending this to everybody who was on the team last year and a few girls who, who've talked to me and expressed interest. If you know of anybody else, please shoot, uh, shoot them an email, forward this to them. Uh, you can also, if you have any questions, email me. Uh, or send you know, any kids my direction who are interested and who want to know more about cross country. I think we have one of the most fun, uh, fun and awesome teams in the school. You know, you're, you guys are really good to each other. You're a pleasure to coach. And I look forward to seeing you guys all again soon. And let me know if you have any questions. But like I said, keep running, uh, getting in shape for the season. And I hope to see you guys very soon. We don't know when camp will be, but I, I'm I'm really hoping that we'll have some camp, some summer camp days this summer where we can all get together and run. Okay, until next time, one, two, three, West. See you guys later.